Hey guys, I'm the Burke and I do things. And today's video is going to be a kind of collaborative haul of things I've bought over the last three weeks. This isn't like a braggy video. This is more like things that I bought while in quarantine for one reason or another. And I will say this isn't everything. So I did buy five things from the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale. I have three out of the five here right now. So I think I'm gonna just make a separate video with those products later on once everything's delivered. I also did place a Bath and Body Works order. That's not here yet. And I have bought two things from Etsy to support smaller businesses. Those aren't here yet, but this is like a couple things that I have purchased while being stuck at home. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I've picked up while being trapped here, then keep on watching. Let's go. Okay, so the first order was from Target. So we have been playing a lot of board games here and I wanted to see what I could get from Target and I have a Target credit card, which means I could always get free shipping from Target, except right now with everything going on, there is now a $25 minimum for shipping. So I did pick out a game for us, but I still needed to hit that threshold. So I picked up two things in this order that were things I'd been eyeing for some time now. Now in my, Brands I want to try in 2020 video, I said I wanted to try Juno & Co. And I had seen that they are available at Target. But I had, you know, in the past month or so, when in my local Target, looked for the brand and I hadn't seen it in store. So I wound up ordering one of the sponges from Target. I got the lavender sponge. I honestly don't know anything about these sponges. If you guys have any insight on how to use these so I can learn. Feel free, do I use it dry or do I wet it? I don't really know much about it. I've seen people use it, but I don't really get it. I'm excited to try it out, but honestly, like, I don't know much about it. So I have to figure it out. And then I also bought a lip product as well that I had been eyeing up for a while. It's one of the new lip products from e.l.f. It's their Sheer Slick Lipstick, and I got it in the orange shade. I really do like orangey shades in the summertime, and the sheerness of it made me wonder if it's like going to be a really easy orange to wear because it's not going to be like super overpowering. So I thought it would be fun to give that a try. Which of these was next? I think my Ulta order was next. So in addition to the Ulta 21 Days of Beauty sale, I had to make another purchase. This was actually in one of my vlogs. So I have been vlogging our entire experience as well. I don't know if it's being stuck inside, if it's the stress of the world, if it's the diet or every, anything, but my, my acne has come back with like a vengeance. <laughs> that I haven't seen since like last summer. So I actually wound up placing an order for the UFO oil from Sunday Riley. This is what really helped clear my skin up last summer. I'm still in the process of clearing it up, but I, I knew myself that it wasn't going to happen on its own unless I bought this product again. So I had to bite the bullet and get this, even though it wasn't something I wanted to necessarily <laughs> invest $40 in because I only bought the half an ounce. I think the full ounce is $80. So I only spent $40. Lucky me. Okay, then I placed an order with Sephora. My hair, it's not doing well. <laughs> and I know that I have to do something to take care of it because it's the ends are really dried out. And it's because when it's short like this, I have to heat style it a lot more to get it under control. So I wanted to try this product from Olaplex, their bonding oil. I don't know. I've been using it for about, I've been using this maybe about a week now trying it out. I can't tell if it's doing anything yet, but I'm trying it. You'll have to let me know. Do you guys have any like tricks for really dry ends? Because I'm trying to grow my hair out and <laughs> it's just, it's not feeling well. So I don't know. Let me know if you guys have any products that really, really help. Everything else in this order I haven't actually tried out yet. So I also bought this from DP Hue. This is their apple cider hair rinse. Uh, yeah. I also have a lot of issues with my scalp, so I wanted to get this to try it out. I don't know, my hair, it's not doing well. So Sephora does have free shipping now for under $50 if you use the code free ship. But I know if you use free ship, you don't get to use one of their promo codes for like one of their free items. So I really wanted to hit free shipping. So I wound up picking up this from the Sephora brand. It's a makeup brush spray. I have a different one from them that I wanted to get because I'm about halfway out of this one but this one was sold out. <laughs> so I'm gonna try this one instead when this one runs out. But these are just like pretty cheap, like daily brush cleansers. I wanted to hit that free shipping number. And you guys are gonna laugh because the promo I wanted to redeem for was the new Milk, Ma Milk Makeup Vegan Moisturizer because I've, he I've heard so many people raving about it. Let me show you this, this promo. 
I don't know if this could physically be any tinier. <laughs> it's like the size of a quarter. Ugh. I mean, I'm excited to try it out because I'm not going to be buying it anytime soon. I have way too much to go through in my collection, but it's so tiny. It's crazy. Okay, and then the two free samples I picked up, one's from Amika. Oh, I definitely didn't pick this out. I never pick out shampoo and conditioner samples, so that was not what I picked out, but I know I picked this out, this out, the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen. I love this sunscreen. Lucky and happy to have that. Then I redeemed two 100 point rewards. One is the Dry Bar Detox Dry Shampoo. Big fan of this product, but I know this size can from them is like two to three uses for me, so I'll have two to three good hair days. And then I also redeemed 100 points for the Ilia Limitless Lash Mascara. I've heard a lot of people raving about this mascara, so it's free, I'll try it out. <laughs> and then in this video, I have one more video, one more video, one more haul from Target. So the 10th, which I guess when you're seeing this is yesterday, but the 10th is Luigi's second birthday. And I like throwing little birthday parties for them. And I tried to get something on Amazon for his birthday, but the Amazon shipping is just so far out in the future that I couldn't find anything, so I was like, you know what, let me look at Target. I found something at Target, but again, it was not $25. So I grabbed a couple other things that I, one is I want, two, two of them are needs. So I grabbed two pack of my deodorant because it might be a pandemic, but I still need this. So this is the deodorant I've been using for years, the Degrees Men Cool Rush deodorant. This is my baby. And then I grabbed two more, elf products so apart from the sheer lipstick the other new product i've been really wanting to try from elf is their halo glow setting powder this sounds amazing and like something i would absolutely love so i'm very excited to try this out i think it's just like a glowy setting powder which is perfection and then this last product is probably one of the oldest products from elf but i was watching katie marie's video on small makeup brushes i'm going to link the video down below if you're into learning about small makeup brushes, but she talked about this one from e.l.f., their concealer brush. It's this tiny, tiny little brush. And I was like, I have so many of these OG white makeup brushes from e.l.f., and I've never bought this teeny tiny concealer one, but like, look how tiny that is. I don't have anything that tiny to just especially get like right in the inner corner. So I was like, now is the time, and I bought it. So this has been my quarantine haul. Let me know, do you guys also want to see a separate haul that has the things I bought from Etsy and the Bath and Body Works haul? Let me know if, I don't, like I don't want to sound like braggy when I do videos like this right now, but I just want to be honest with you guys, like this is what I'm going through. I'm having hair problems. I can't go to a hairdresser. <laughs> I am having breakouts. I needed something to take care of myself. So yeah, this is my life right now. So let me know what you want me to do for you on the internet. And yeah, that is it for this video. As usual, thanks for stopping by my channel. If you're new here, click the subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications. I have my Twitter and my Instagram down below. Give them a follow and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.